Hey, what's going on everybody? Hope we're doing great today. Happy Saturday. We got 13 matchups on this NHL slate today. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. Definitely helps out the channel. And also, guys, last two days for pre-registration in North Carolina with FanDuel, DraftKings, BetMGM, Bet365. Those links are in the description. Sign up with the pre-registration. Get $100 in bonus bets on top of your 200 in bonus bets for uh, making your deposit. Take advantage of the pre-registration, guys, if you're in North Carolina. It's the last two days you can do so, so be sure to take advantage of that. And uh, yeah, guys, we'll hop in it here. Busy slate today. A lot of matchups, starting with the Carolina Hurricanes versus the New Jersey Devils. Carolina opening up as road favorites at minus 150. The Devils plus 130 with the over-under at 6.5. Carolina coming into this matchup 37-19-6. The Devils 31-28-4. Head-to-head Carolina 7-3 in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Carolina coming off a Montreal win. Devils coming off a St. Louis win. Uh, Carolina 6-1 against New Jersey. So they've been very good head-to-head. -head. Uh, the unders hit in six of their last seven games. So maybe the unders a decent play today. And um, yeah, I like they've been good head-to-head -head here. The unders hit in six of their last seven on the road as well. So making a strong case for the under here. I like Carolina in this matchup. Going to roll with the Hurricanes on the road. Next matchup, we got the Edmonton Oilers versus the Buffalo Sabres. Edmonton opening up as road favorites at minus 190. Buffalo plus 160 with the over-under at 6.5. Edmonton coming into this matchup 38-21-2. Buffalo 29-30-5. Head-to-head, Buffalo 6-4 in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Edmonton coming off a Columbus loss. Tough Columbus loss for Edmonton. Buffalo on a three-game losing streak, coming off a Nashville loss. Uh, yeah, bad three-game losing streak there on. A uh, tough three-game stretch for Buffalo here. Edmonton is 4-1 and one on the road, so they've been decent on the road here. The unders hit in five of their last six, and then the unders hit in seven of Buffalo's last nine here. So maybe the unders are a good play today. And um, I like Edmonton here. Buffalo, yeah, hasn't looked good this last week. And uh, I think I'm going to roll with the Oilers on the road. Next matchup, we got the Nashville Predators versus the Columbus Blue Jackets. Nashville opening up as road favorites at minus 150. Columbus plus 125 with the over-under at 6.5. Nashville coming into this matchup 36-25-3. Columbus 22-31-10. Head to head, Nashville six and three and six three and one in the last ten head to head meetings. Uh, Nashville coming off a Buffalo win. Columbus coming off an Ed, a nice Edmonton win here. Uh, Nashville, they're still playing amazing. Nine and one in their last ten. Fourteen and six against Columbus. Five and zero oh on the road here. Um, yeah, I'm liking the Predators here. They, you know. Buffalo, I'm sorry, not Buffalo. Columbus coming off a nice win against Edmonton here, but Nashville's hot right now, and uh, I think I'm going to take the Predators on the road. Next matchup, we got the Pittsburgh Penguins versus the Boston Bruins. Bruins opening up as home favorites at minus 200. Pittsburgh plus 170 with the over-under at 6. Pittsburgh coming into this matchup 28-25-8. Boston 37-13-15. Head-to-head, -head. Boston 6-4 and four in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Uh, Pittsburgh 1-4 and four in their last five. Been a touch tough uh, five-game stretch for Pittsburgh. Coming off a 6-0 to zero loss against Washington. Bruins coming off a Toronto win. Pittsburgh 3-13 and 13 on the road against Boston. 2-8 and eight on the road. Yeah, I just don't know if I can trust Pittsburgh here. They've looked like a mess this last week. I think I got to roll with the Bruins at home. Next matchup, we got the Calgary Flames versus the Florida Panthers. 
Florida opening up as home favorites at minus 220. Calgary plus 180 with the over under at 6. Calgary coming into this matchup 31 26 and 5. Florida 43 17 and 4. Head to head Calgary 7 2 and 1 in the last 10 head to head meetings. Calgary coming off a Tampa Bay win. They're playing very well right now. They're 6 and 1, 6 and 1 in their last 7. Florida coming off a tough Flyers loss, ending their six game winning streak they were on. Actually, they were on a, no, yeah, they were on a six game winning streak. Calgary, seven and one on the road, six and one against Florida. So they've been good head to head. The overs hitting Calgary's each of the last five games. So maybe the overs a decent play today. And the way Calgary's playing right now, I think they're a great dog today. I'm going to take a shot with Calgary plus one and a half on the road. Next matchup, we got the Chicago Blackhawks versus the Washington Capitals. Washington opening up as home favorites at minus 230. Chicago plus 190 with the over under at five and a half. Chicago coming into this matchup 16, 42 and five. Washington 29, 23 and nine. Head to head Washington 6 2 and 2 in the last 10 head to head meetings. Chicago coming off a Arizona win, ending their big losing streak they were on. Washington coming off that 6 0 sweep against Pittsburgh. And uh, yeah, Chicago 1 and 19 on the road, 1 and 8 on the road against Washington. Not too much confidence with Chicago because they just cannot win on the road. And uh, I think I'm going to take the Capitals at home. Next matchup, we've got the Ottawa Senators versus the San Jose Sharks. Ottawa opening up as road favorites at minus 200. San Jose plus 170 with the over-under at 6.5. Ottawa coming into this matchup 25-32-4. The Sharks 15-40-7. Head-to-head Ottawa 6-4 in the last 10 head-to-head meetings. Ottawa uh, on a six-game losing streak right now. Coming off an L.A. loss. San Jose, they're on a nine-game losing streak right now. Bad stretch for San Jose. Um, got neither team playing very inspiring right now. Uh, Ottawa, 0-5 on the road. 1-4 and on the road against San Jose. The way Ottawa's looked here, I just don't know if I can take them on the road here as big favorites. I'm going to take a shot with the Sharks plus one and a half at home today. Next matchup, we got the Philadelphia Flyers versus the Tampa Bay Lightning. Lightning opening up as home favorites at minus 140. The Flyers plus 120 with the over under at six and a half. Um, Flyers coming into this matchup 33, 23 and eight. The Lightning 33, 25 and six. Head to head Tampa Bay 7 and 3 in the last 10 head to head meetings. The Flyers coming off a Florida win. Tampa Bay coming off a Calgary loss. The Flyers are just 3 and 13 against Tampa Bay. 4 and 14 on the road against Tampa. I mean, they've been horrible against the Lightning here, especially on the road. And um they actually beat Tampa Bay in their last meeting 6 to 2. As an underdog here, um, I think it's a great bounce back spot for Tampa Bay at home where they've been dominant against the Flyers. Give me a shot with the Lightning at home in this one. Next matchup, we got the Toronto Maple Leafs versus the Montreal Canadiens. Toronto opening up as road favorites at minus 215. Montreal plus 180 with the over under at 6.5. Toronto coming into this matchup 36 19 and 8. Montreal 24, 29, and 10. Head to head. Toronto 3 0 in the last three head to head meetings. Toronto coming off a Boston loss. Montreal coming off a Carolina loss. Uh, Montreal just 2 and 8 in their last 10 right now. Been a real struggle for Montreal. Toronto. Um. Uh, Four and one on the road. You know, they've been good on the road here. Montreal. Yeah, I just can't trust Montreal. They've looked horrible here. 
And uh, I think it's a good spot for Toronto on the road. Give me the Maple Leafs in this one. Next matchup, we got the St. Louis Blues versus the New York Rangers. Rangers opening up as home favorites at minus 215. The Blues plus 170 with the over-under at 6. Blues coming into this matchup 32-28-3. The Rangers 40-18-4. Head-to-head St. Louis 6-4 in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. St. Louis on a two-game losing streak. Uh, they're 3-7 in their last 10 right now. Rangers coming off a tough two-game stretch against Florida and Toronto. Uh, St. Louis 1-6 on the road. They've, strugg they've struggled on the road here. Rangers 6-1 at home. 5-2 at home against St. Louis here. And yeah, with the Blues struggling... Rangers off a two-game stretch. Definitely a winnable game with St. Louis here. I think I'm going to roll with the Rangers at home. Next matchup, we've got the Detroit Red Wings versus the Vegas Golden Knights. Vegas opening up as home favorites at minus 175. Detroit plus 150 with the over-under at 6.5. Detroit coming into this matchup 33-24-6. Vegas 33-23-7. Head-to-head -head Detroit, 6-4 and four in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Uh, Detroit on a four-game losing streak. Coming off an Arizona loss. Vegas on a four-game losing streak. Coming off a Vancouver loss. Uh, yeah, it's been tough for Vegas. 2-8 and eight in their last 10. Detroit getting swept last night against Arizona, 4-0. Um, not a good look for Detroit. They're 5-2 against Vegas, though. Vegas currently 0-5 at home. The overs hit in seven of their last eight games, so maybe the overs are a good play. Hard to trust Vegas here. Uh, they got a lot of injuries, and um, yeah, they've been playing absolutely horrible. You know, Detroit, the game they had last night isn't very... Don't feel too convinced, you know, and confident with Detroit, but I just can't trust Vegas here. I'll take a shot with Detroit plus one and a half on the road. Next matchup, we got the Winnipeg Jets versus the Vancouver Canucks. Vancouver opening up as home favorites at minus 140. Vegas plus 120 with the over-under at 6. Winnipeg coming into this matchup 40-17-5. Vancouver 41-17-7. Head-to-head Winnipeg 6-3-1 in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Winnipeg coming off a Seattle win yesterday. Nice 3-0 win for them. Uh, Vancouver on a three-game winning streak. Coming off a Vegas win. Winnipeg. They're 4-1 and one against Vancouver. 10-2 and two on the road against Vancouver, where they've been very good. And um, I think they're a good dog today. Tough matchup for both teams. I'll take a shot with Winnipeg plus one and a half on the road. Then the last matchup, we got the Dallas Stars versus the Los Angeles Kings. Kings opening up as home favorites at minus 120. Dallas plus 100 with the over-under at 6.5. Dallas coming into this matchup 39-17-9. The Kings 32-19-11. Head-to-head Dallas 7-3 in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Uh, Dallas, they're on a four-game winning streak coming off an Anaheim win. Kings coming off an Ottawa win. Dallas, 4-1 against LA, so they've been good head-to-head. -head. The Unders hit in 7 of their last 9 games. Same with LA, the Unders hit in 7 of their last 10, so maybe the Unders are a good play today. And I think Dallas is a good underdog on the road. I'll take a shot with Dallas, plus 1.5 here. And that's going to be it for the video. Good luck with your picks and parlays on Saturday. Hope you guys all cash out, and I'll see you guys Sunday. Have a good one.